right, today I would like to inform all of you about the manatee, which happens to be the kindest creature on the planet and also my spirit animal. So, please. The manatee is also known as the cow of the sea. There are three different species of manatee across the world. And, fun fact, their closest relative is the elephant. Um, so, mermaids. How many believe mermaids are real? Yeah, I do. Yes, we love Ariel. Actually, mermaids are real. They are manatees. Um, so, back in the day when people traveled a lot on boats, they would see manatees and manatees eat seaweed. So, they would have seaweed in their mouth and it would be like flowing out and looks like hair. And then they have the tail. So, it is believed that the manatee is the origin of the legend of the mermaid. So, we owe it to the manatees for Ariel. That's great. Manatees are actually endangered. Um, there are approximately 5,000 left in the U.S. and their death rate is higher than they're reproducing. So if the trend continues, eventually manatees will be extinct. They have no natural predators, so humans are to blame um, for the fact that they're endangered. Um, they're often hunted for their food, their hides, and their bones. Also, this is a picture of coastal development. Um, which shows this is where the manatees normally would inhabit, but man has taken over that, so that adds pollution, that takes away their food sources and messes up their migration patterns. Um, they are protected by law in the 70s. The Marine Mammal Protection Act and the Endangered Species Act was passed. So if you harass, harm, hurt, kill a manatee, you will be fined or even imprisoned. So be careful out there. Um, also, what is it like? To be a manatee. I'm going to take you through a normal day for a manatee so you know. So you're going to live in the western Atlantic or coast of Brazil which is also nice. You love coastal waters or freshwater inlets um, and warm waters. Manatees won't go in water that's below 68 degrees. Um, they also love regions around power plants because that makes the water warmer um, near the coast so you can see a lot of them gathering there. For your health as a manatee, you could be up to 12 feet long, which is very long. It's like more than twice my length. Um, you could also weigh 3,500 pounds, which is a lot, um, and grow 50 to 60 years old. So, your pastime as a manatee. You love eating and you love floating. That's pretty much all they do. They just eat food and they just kind of like rest and float there. Um, they can also travel around. They normally go about five miles per hour. Um, if they're like scared, they can go like 15 to 20 in a short burst, but they normally just, just go along at their own pace. Um, they are very curious creatures, so they love to investigate and they socialize. So what will you eat as a manatee? You eat sea grasses and freshwater vegetation. Um, they often consume up to 100 pounds of food a day. Hardly why they are my spirit animal. I think that's a beautiful life and a beautiful existence. <laughs> So, social for a manatee. The distinct social class for a manatee, you'll normally see a mom and a calf, like pictured here. When calves are born, they're 60 to 70 pounds and three to four feet long at birth. Um, so that's normally how they travel, is just in that pair. They can also be seen alone or in small groups. They are extremely gentle. So they aren't seen fighting each other, they aren't aggressive or territorial. Okay, so communication. As a manatee, you chirp, whistle, or squeak. And these noises can be heard up to 200 feet away. Um, we can come back and listen to this video of them. Here are my sources where I found all of this lovely information. And that's the end. So we'll go back to this and um, it's just a short video. Wow, this is great. Just imagine you tell me I love you, man. Super cool.